Anyone's ever brought me up ever. <laughs> this guy is fucking successful. What the fuck? <laughs> I love Sarah, man. She makes me not homophobic every time I see her. <laughs> Two girls, I'm cool with that shit. Two guys, get out of here. <laughs> this is a clam only broil. <laughs> That'd be weird if I was like only homo uh, homophobic for one side. Like, no, no dudes, man. I just want ladies on ladies. I want hockey players only. Field hockey. <laughs> Thank you guys for coming. This is the second time in one year I got to come here. Things have, uh, are either going well or I have a limited worldview on where I can travel. <laughs> I love coming to San Diego, man. This is great. Things are a little bit slower out here. The crackheads are, are, are better tanned. <laughs> They're much nicer too, man. Like they'll come up to you, help you for directions. I like it. I stayed at, I, 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 every time I'm at a hotel, I do one thing. I jack off in the sink. <laughs> thing number two, I, I turn on the water. I watch it go down in the sink. That draw is a lot worse every time I come here. <laughs> Thank you for coming. I, I would not have come. <laughs> I love doing nothing. That's my shit. Home is great. Outside is dangerous. That's where wars happen. Every war happened outside. That's a historical fact. <laughs> Inside is safe. I love being home. I loved COVID. I trained my whole life for COVID. I didn't even know. They said, stay home, save lives. I said, yes, sir. <laughs> I'm home too much. I got a favorite streaming service. There's people in other countries that don't have food or water. They also don't got Hulu. <laughs> I do. With ads, you know, you can't flex. <laughs> when you got Hulu with ads, it's basic economy Hulu. It's rough, like you get, when you got Hulu with ads, you get two minutes of show, 38 minutes of ads. <laughs> I've been watching Bob's Burgers for five years. I'm on episode four. <laughs> and the ads, because they know you're broke, you got no money, all the ads are organ donor ads. <laughs> I swear to God. They're like, give up your heart, it's not a game, bitch. <laughs> You gotta be careful what you watch when you have Hulu with ads too, cause you can't watch what everyone else gets to watch. Hulu gaslights the shit out of you thinking you can though. Like you type in a show and they're like, we have this exact show you wanna watch. You wanna watch? I'm like, yeah. They're like, too bad you broke bitch. <laughs> this requires showtime. <laughs> Maybe if you're out working, instead of watching TV, you can watch this shit. <laughs> you gotta watch whatever Hulu offers you. You gotta be careful, it fucks your life up. I don't know what the algorithm is, but the algorithm knows me. I recommended a documentary to me called Hitler's Mustache and fuck my whole life up. <laughs> All my recommendations now are just Nazi, 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 Nazi. I bring women over for Netflix and chill, which I can't afford. I got Hulu with ads. I put on all Nazis. It scares the hosts. <laughs> so I said, I was intrigued. So I said, let me buy a book about the Nazis. Not great timing on my behalf. <laughs> Especially, I live in New York. I don't know if you ever tried, I don't know if you know it's about New York. A lot of Jews, right? Like, I said it that way so it didn't sound hateful. Jews, it's like a fun little slide. It'd be different, I was like, there's a lot of fucking Jews in New York. You'd be like, calm down, Kanye, what do we do? <laughs> you gotta be careful how you read a book that has a big ass swastika on the cover when you're on the train. Like, the only way to do it is to look disappointed every time you turn a page. Like, I'm just like, <laughs> I don't like this guy. <laughs> Way to ruin a mustache, buddy. <laughs> Reading Nazi books confirmed something I, I, I always knew, uh, that German Shepherds are, are racist dogs. <laughs> That's a racist ass dog. Why were you Hitler's favorite? <laughs> Joe Biden's dog is a German Shepherd. He bit 11 Secret Service agents. <laughs> Do you know how many Secret Service agents you have to bite for that shit to not be a secret anymore? 11, apparently. It's the same amount of herbs and spices in KFC, 11. <laughs> and Joe got to walk around the White House every day talking about, hey man, the dog don't bite. <laughs> <laughs> he named him Commander. What do you think he's going to do? Just sit idly by? No, he's trying to join the service. 
Or like the dog and Joe Biden, some Freaky Friday shit went down. They switched bodies. <laughs> And Joe keeps biting Secret Service agents in the dog body to warn the Secret Service agents, like, hey, something happened. And like, nah, we like dog brains. That shit, dog brains is passing a lot of legislation. They're racist. German Shepherds are a racist dog. You can't deny. You ever hear them bark? Hard R every time. And they smile after they say it too, like, <laughs> If you think all dogs go to heaven, you don't know much about the civil rights movement, but let's just say German shepherds and fire hoses are going straight to hell. Most police dogs are German shepherds. Connect those dots. They know three tricks. Sit, roll over, turn your body camera off. That's all they know how to do. All right? People see a police dog, they lose their shit, right? And I, I see a police dog, I'm like, where were you January 6th? Why you got your sunglasses behind your head? How you do that with no thumbs? 